hi guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video so let us learn a javascript program to accept three numbers from the user and try to find the average of these three numbers and try to display the average of three numbers onto the html page so that is a problem statement so let us try to solve this using the javascript so this is my windows command prompt and i am into this particular directory that is public javascript so let us try to create a html file and insert the javascript over it and try to execute the html file so let me use the notepad and try to create a html file so let's say average 3 dot html so this is my html file so let us try to create it so do you want to create a new file let's say yes let us maximize it and yeah so let us insert the script tag over it yeah so once we add a script tag so we have to uh, add the ht that is the javascript over here so let's let us take three variables a b c and try to ask a user to enter first second and third values so let uh, a equals to so let's use the prompt and try to check if uh, that is try to ask a user to enter first uh, number so let's say enter enter first number yeah so once the user enters so it will be a first string type so let us convert it into floating type so using parse float function call so now let me copy paste the same so we have to ask three values that is a b c copy pasting the same but we have to end it with a semicolon i have missed it so let's end it with a semicolon and also copy paste the same for the b and c values so let's replace the variable names b and c and this is the first let's change it to second number and let's change it to the third number so the reason i am using float is because integer also fits into the float so that's the reason i am trying to use the parse float over here so now let's check if the in uh, that is user entered values are not a that is valid uh, numbers so for that let's use the if statement and try, try to check if is man so this is a function that checks if the that is user entered values are really float or something else that is an invalid user input so is man so let us try to check b value and also is nan for the third variable that is c so if this is true if either of the three values entered by the user is invalid so let us try to print a that is a negative uh, message and try to exit the javascript so let's say document dot write so i am using document dot write in order to print on the html page itself so if you want to move it to the that is console error so you can use console dot error over here instead of document dot write so for the display purpose i am just using document dot write so let's say invalid numbers entered so this is a negative message that uh, for the negative scenario for invalid uh, user input so let's take a else block and uh, try to find the average of these three numbers that is a b and uh, c and uh, try to print it onto the html page so this for the positive scenario where user has entered that is valid numbers so let uh, average is equals to so let's uh, try to add a plus b plus c and try to divide it by three so this will give us the average of three numbers so let's use document dot write so once we are done finding the average of three numbers so let us try to print it so let's say average of three numbers is so let's give colon and let us try to print the average 
so this is a variant so let's uh, end this with a semicolon yeah so this is a complete javascript to accept uh, three numbers from the user and uh, try to find the average of three numbers and display it display it onto the html page so you can also use the console.log instead of the document.write so let me save this and uh, let us try to execute it exiting the javascript so now let's use the explorer to this explorer and try to execute the average 3 so enter the first number so let's say a value of a is 12 then 13 and 14 so we can see average of three numbers is 13 so let me re-execute it by pressing f5 that is function 5 key so enter the first number let's say something like 2.3 second number is 4.5 and the third number is 6.7 so you can see average of three numbers is 4.5 so let us re-execute it by pressing f5 let's say 2 then something like 55 then something like uh, 34 so you can see average of three numbers is 30.33 it has printed that is uh, this big value that is after a floating point value it has printed this big number so you can also use the floating point formatting over here so let us re-execute it for the invalid scenario so let's say something like i'll uh, enter a string so let's say hello one two so you can see invalid numbers enter so we had entered a string so that's why it is throwing invalid numbers enter it's a error message so let me close this so yeah so this is a complete javascript program to accept three numbers integer or floating point values and try to find the average of the three numbers so i'll give this code in the description of this video so that's it in this video hope you liked it thank you for watching bye